something wasn't quite right, but she wasn't sure what it was right. Then the dog barked, but when asked about it, she would deny everything. After she left, she quickly took the scissors. She had to get it off before she got back, or she'd be caught red-handed. Jordan Reynolds was a 14-year-old boy who took great pride in his hair. For the last nine years, he had elegant dreadlocks. It felt like a part of his DNA. He was a middle child to Melanie, mom, and dad Max. Max was better known as Max Beatbox, the Unuber. Jordan was encouraged to be creative at a young age and express himself in any way he could. Both his siblings were also encouraged to be who they were and find their own way of expressing themselves. Jordan's father was a musician that made music for many different places, like TV, movies, and even commercials. He wanted his children to pursue their passion as he did his. Dreadlocks have dated back to the Bronze Age. There are many depictions of the Minim people wearing dreadlocks in murals. Even mummies found in Egypt have been found to be wearing deadlock headdresses. Aztecs have also been shown to have been wearing dreadlocks. This meant Jordan's hairstyle had a deep heritage. Jordan assumed that his dog wanted to go outside or walk when he started to bark, but his mom had other suspicions. What was going on behind the scenes? Jordan would eventually learn the real reason behind everything. Henry had never been vocal before, but he was now directing his barking at Jordan. It was strange, and he couldn't figure out why. It is a common belief that dreadlocks are unhygienic, but even if they are low maintenance, they do still require cleaning. Jordan was worried that perhaps the dog didn't like him anymore. He tried to bond with him more by spending more time with him. But even when he had treats, he'd still bark at him. Jordan was frustrated beyond belief, but then his mother realized something he hadn't. Henry wasn't barking at Jordan. Henry would actually smell Jordan's hair before barking at him. He couldn't understand why it was going on. Dogs have incredible senses of smell and Melanie knew this. She was alarmed, she knew he was barking for a reason. It could have been a warning. Jordan didn't believe his mother and blatantly brushed off the idea. He then changed the subject very quickly. Melanie doubted herself. Maybe she was overcomplicating things. Her son seemed to be fine. He knew best for himself. Little did she know, Jordan wasn't being completely honest. It was on Jordan's mind for a while now that he wanted to change. As a teenager, it's no surprise that he wanted to experiment with different styles, but he had no idea that his mom knew what he was up to. Jordan wanted to surprise her, but he didn't expect his dog, Henry, to react this way. He had to act fast. When his mom was out grocery shopping, Jordan quickly asked his dad to cut his hair but carefully. He asked him to chop off the very top of them and to be careful not to disturb the center of them. Confused, his dad did as he was asked, when his mom returned, Jordan showed her exactly what he had been hiding in his hair. Jordan waited for his mom to return and jumped out to surprise her. She coiled back in shock before realizing that the boy in front of her was her son. Her jaw dropped at the sight of his shaved head. Tears began to fall as she wept for her son's dreadlocks that she had gotten used to since he was five years old. But there was more. Jordan brought her over to the dreads that sat on the table. He asked her to look inside. She cut the dreads and watched as a collage of small photos appeared. They showed Jordan from when he was five until now. Melanie burst out in tears at how much her little boy had grown up. She loved his dreadlocks, and she was super upset to see them go, but she cherished these photos that Jordan prepared for her. And the dog? The reason why Henry was barking at Jordan's hair is still a mystery. Perhaps he could smell the rolled-up photos and knew they weren't supposed to be there. Or maybe he did really just want extra love and attention from Jordan. Either way, they're all living peacefully together now. Thank you for watching. Please don't forget to like, subscribe and share this video with your friends and family.